um, this bird right here, yeah. you see with these, instead of throwing those, it throws these. Yeah. Not, 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 not the no. whole thing. Just, Just these, like, as if they're, like, blade feathers that it generates from its, like, body somehow and instantly replaces. Yeah, so, it. yeah, whoever, you know, who is gay in the series, I, I don't know, whatever, um, you know, he has to be rescued from, you know, some, like, big mean like you know rapey fuda you know women and then by this bird guy who like throws these that like stick in there you know <laughs> yeah yeah in their like butts you know like stick out and they're like ow and run off you know <sighs> okay <clears throat> all i gotta say is ignore all of this yeah bong that's oh right oh my bong, god we bong, <laughs> the weed <laughs> <laughs> we weed smoky wheezy guys oh man so they like have been hanging out in the dank dank a you part know. of the swamp yeah, yeah or it grows you know an experimental patch you know by the um uh greenhouse you know a professor you know yeah it's a funny point Yeah, so they've been hanging out in the dank, dank part of the swamp, and they, they're big O. Yeah. They're big O, um, <laughs> which is a type of weed that makes you horny in the swamp. Dude, it's so <laughs> strong as a skull and crossbones, because, like, they're going around, and they're, like, you know, their chimneys, they're, like, raping the sexy food of women, you know? And then, like, it's, like, filling them up with super potent... Oh, you know, it pumps smoke. it through their dick hole, yes, and it yeah. fills up the, you know, their bodies with gas, so yeah. then they're, they're, they're really hyper horny. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Deadly horny. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, I mean, all it takes is for Ash to catch him to get one whiff, and then Pikachu's all over him. Yeah. That's intense. <laughs> okay, um, this dude... I kind of like I kind of like this artwork. He's a little bit more of a smug bastard than this one. He's a little yeah. bit more annoying than in the other yeah. one. Yeah, I don't know. Definitely. I, that has nothing to do with anything. This is the end of the video. Oh okay. <laughs> um. Oh, this, this. You see this right here? Yeah. What about it? <laughs> is is that am I involved? <laughs> you have the clown. Yeah. Drinking <laughs> Armin's Black Booster Whiskey. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, sure, why not? <laughs> that should about do it. Time to rape some Pokemon. We must collect their evolutionary essence to evolve a new race of Super Pokemon. That What's sounds uh, like the true calling of any. Uh, Harvest their titty milk in brand new Pokemon Snap Triple X video game. Available now. Yeah, so I think that the Crowley here, he kind of he kind of looks like you know uh, this a little bit. You know, he he's definitely got a little bit of a widow's peak here, but you gotta like puff up his hair all nerdy and stuff, and he grows like a tiny bit of a chin beard. <laughs> yeah. So you get him in Pokemon Snap Triple X. And then, uh... Yeah, he goes, oh, 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 oh. He goes yeah. crazy when he sees all the yeah, big Yeah, because he's pretending like he wasn't just a guy who was taking the pictures of all the hot, sexy babes yeah. that are supposedly Pokemon. You know, they're all Pokemon-esque. Yeah. But he actually just is, and he's just the new Professor Oak, but instead he just wants you to snap pictures of those Pokemon bitches, and that's where Kitty Boy Johnny comes in. And he, he's going around snapping pictures, but also collecting Pokemon, you know. And he brings the specially hot bitch specimens back to Professor Oak. Oh. Yeah, Professor. with the plush Pokeballs with the velvet exteriors. Yes, but back to Professor Mirror. It's the greatest plot ever. It's, it's This then movie the, must be made immediately. Then the animal husbandry is carried out by these two. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Moo. Real plot team Rocket from the original series is that they're like always like doing the blow end tasks for the organization because everybody thinks they're idiots and they're always scheming to think that they're super sinister and that they can like do some amazing thing that'll impress everyone. So, uh, in this case, they're taking the uh, experimental chemical waste remains uh, in some barrels in their like hot air balloon scenario thing. So then a giant pokey bird, you know, lands on top of the, uh, 
on top of like the three headed bird. <laughs> and it like lands on top of the balloon and like, you know, the cat guy, he like, you know, goes up there and like scares it off and before it can like peck the balloon for no reason. Then he's all like, Oh, what a relief and then he like, you know, tries to scale down the side of the balloon with his claws out and pops it anyways. So then he all falls back into the basket as one of the balloons is popped because there's, like, multiple. So it's all like they're going down or whatever. And as they get near the ground, the uh, basket tips and the uh, chemicals dump into the bog and Jessie falls in. And then uh, she comes out and she's, like, mutating. She's got, like, awesome, you know, veins. And she's, like, turning into, like, you know, like a frog bitch. And she's got, like, a big juicy cock, you know? <laughs> Cause she like landed in a big pile of, fro of frogs with the mutation sauce. Yeah. And then, uh, you know, it's causing a Pokemon outbreak of, you know, dicks on the sexy bitches. Yep. It's a genetic mutation in Pokemon. And you have to, uh, <laughs> the only way you can cure it is to, uh, get all of the, uh, sexy semen out of them that's contaminated with the, uh, with the chemical, you know. Yes. It's the only way. Yeah, that's why it's called Pokemon <laughs> Pokemon Triple X. Yeah. I guess so. Because <laughs> of the Chemical X. Yeah. And because of the hardcore fucking, of course. Yeah. Okay, so the plot here is that you see little little Crowley nigga here looking all grown up because he doesn't even look this old. So, you know, anyways, the, you know, you kind of dress him up like he's older so he looks like a fancy boy. But then he goes out on his own, of course, you know, after, uh, you know, Ash says it's too dangerous to go out into the wild, you know, because what happens is he goes in that stupid, stupid little, little dorky submarine they show somewhere. Anyways, it's in there. You fly, you go around and then it breaks open, you know, and him and Pikachu fall out. And so <laughs> him and Pikachu fall out. And they get some of the, you know, because animals are rowdy, like, you know, an angry rhino, whatever the fuck those are called, bison, is, like, fighting over, like, a zebra's ass with, like, a, with, like, a, a, a Venusaur or something, you know what I mean, or Bulbasaur, I don't even give a shit. So, <laughs> what happens is... He falls out and gets some of the chemical that's, like, you know, leaking out of their wounds on him, you know, because they're all being violent. He's like, stop! Oh! You know, Ash acts. Yeah. Like, he's always being a little pussy that's that's super high. So then, um... Then, uh, Crowley here is like... Okay, uh... Well, the only, uh, cure for the, the stuff getting on you is you gotta, you know, expunge it all from your body. Do you have a strong electric charge? You know, you know what I'm saying, Crowley, Crowley, you gotta say this, you gotta say this convincingly. Yeah. Convincingly. Yeah. With a straight face. And then you gotta be like, like how, how they used to say, use Thunderbolt attack to, to make Pikachu do whatever the fuck. Then he's gotta be like, you gotta make Pikachu use a Thunderbolt attack. And then Pikachu's dick swells massively in size because he's always getting shock therapy by Ash. And he, he's always giving Ash shock therapy. Yeah. So then it swells up, and then it's like how the regular dildos that Kitty Boy Johnny actually, you know, has sex with. Yeah. Which I think are a little big, honestly. Anyways, um... Because he goes super penis mode. He yeah. goes super penis mode. And then he gets all hyper-shocked, and then, you know, they have women come in and stick his hair up in every direction, you know, yeah. so it's like he's a maximum shock. Yeah. And then it's like, chill! <laughs> you know, lightning all around his body. Yeah. As he uses his thunder dick attack. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's so funny. I don't know. That's what I've come up with so far. So are you saying that Crowley goes out the professor and he investigates these Futanari Pokemon himself? Is that what we're saying? Yeah, I'm saying after Ash determines it's too dangerous and is just wandering around somewhere safe in the woods, like, picking apples, then he goes out and he's, you know, zooming in on all the hot booty action, because he's the, he's the guy when he was younger from, it's like the previous plot, like, flashbacks yeah. from Pokemon Snap Triple X, the original, like... Yeah, so what you're saying is he's always sneaking around, and it's just, it's just... Everything's extra mutated and aggressively, violently sexual, so he's hiding because there's, like, 
big, you know, sexy yeah, just, women that are like, you know, we're like, you know, hippo, you know, Pokemon and stuff. They're like yeah. fucking big time giraffes and stuff. Yeah, and he, he's zooming in, you know, and yeah. taking pictures, and you're, you're viewing it from his perspective. <laughs> yeah, exactly. With the little record thing in the corner. Yeah. So then, you know, you have already him, like, tastefully making comments and not in the middle of, you know, the action, you know. Just no, he right just moments. says a few things at yeah. the beginning and then maybe at the end and then, you know, like, zooms out and acts like, he better move on, you know. Yeah, exactly. It's the greatest. It's it's the greatest. <laughs> now we just need to get a Misty that's actually a redhead. Mm. I, I don't know what age my girlfriend will be, so I don't I don't know if that's going to line up uh, with that. So, probably not. <laughs> yeah, just get her doppelganger to do it. Her doppelganger's a different age. Yes, her doppelganger from the Shadow Realm. No, just get, get, get some redhead. I don't know. I mean, if she's available and looks right, you can get her, but probably not. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. You just gotta get... The the main thing is, number one thing to get right, you gotta have Psyduck in it. And Psyduck has always gotta have the proper migraine. That's all. So at the end, you know... Uh, <laughs> super Psyduck, you know, like, woman <laughs> charges up with, you know, a massive headache on, on her penis head. And uh, super sex charges everybody and forces all the goo back out of them again through, you know, psionic energy. Because, uh, you know. But first they have to, you know, <laughs> orgasm for several minutes straight while, you know, they sweat heavily. Everything, you know, their titties get even bigger, you know. Everything gets more intense. Their pupils dilate. They start orgasming continually. Titty notes <laughs> flying everywhere, you know. <clears throat> they start rolling around, you know, and thrusting with strange angles. <laughs> yes <laughs> oh yeah and uh i keep repeating we need we need a good nurse joy because she's got to have the biggest titties you know what i'm saying <laughs> yeah because she's gonna get like you know the you know the the rock dude with you know the forearms you know he's gonna she's gonna you know be running along a path with, you know, a basket of, of picnic food, and then he'll just jump out to some bushes. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> she wandered into the wrong track and field equipment area. What can I say? Because <laughs> that's what he looks like. I think he's going to do the discus throw. Yeah. No. <laughs> He's her assistant, and then the crazy um, mutation hits him, and then, you know, he grows an extra pair of arms, and that's how that Pokemon mutates. Yeah. Because he's originally just a rock golem, you know, Pokemon that was made long ago, and then he gets upgraded, and he's fully alive, and then he epically fucks her with two penises. <laughs> yes, exactly. You know... <laughs> You know the giant water blue lizard thing? Uh, but it's got, it's all elongated. Its mouth oh, is always agape. Yeah. But it's like a woman. So she's like super massive and explodes out of the water with some of the characteristics, like, yeah. you know, of it. Yeah. But all nude with her titties all erect in the breeze. And, <laughs> and then Crowley's hiding in a little boat in the reeds with a fisherman hat on and like camo all yeah. on his body and on his like giant camera lens. Exactly. So, like, is she, um... And he's using Fujifilm. I don't know why. Just because. Yeah. Is she... Like, how big is she? Like, does she, like, you know, sh show up out of the water and then, like, sexy, like, dolphin dudes and women come up, Pokemon, and, like, alligators, and they're all fucking her as they're, like, orging all over and she's huge? <laughs> no. No, foolish boy. What? There, There's the other Pokemon... Yeah. Uh, there's another giant one. Yeah. It's, I think, a different color, and its face looks slightly different, but it's, like, red. And it's also in the water. Yeah, the, the red one, yeah. So then it comes up as another sexy woman that's enormous with big no, old I huge boobies. The red one was, like, soil. So then it comes up near... Whatever. Either whatever, way, they make yeah. out on the beach or yeah. in the water. And it's super sexy time. 
Yeah. And Crowley takes bunches of photos and goes, mm, occasionally sometimes. Yes, yes, actually huge, yes. <laughs> and he says, excellent shot. Yeah. Of course, they got to come out, they're all scaly, you know, and everything, and they're all smashing their boobs up against each other, you know, and they're, it's initially their nipples got to show through their, you know, getting all hard and, uh, you know, sensuous as they start making out with tiny little bikinis on because it's Pokemon yeah. Snap Triple X. It's but not like, logical. Yeah, and then, like, eventually they take them off. But, like, the bats, I think he needs, like, some drones, but, like, instead they're, like, Pokemon. So, like, he's got, like, a bat... And, like, a crow Pokemon, different stuff. So then they're, like, all, you know, getting shots at different angles of, you know, video and pictures, you know, up around, you know, the huge women making that. Oh, yeah. I agree. Yeah, they gotta be, like, you know, 30 to 50 feet tall, you know, because that's how huge the Pokemon are. Um... I... I I guess I was just going to say that, uh, I don't know. You got to have, you got to have whatever it's called. The one with the tentacles. That's like the, the plant tentacles on it. Bulbasaur, oh, Venusaur. The huge thing? Or are you just the little one? The the little one, I guess. Yeah. You, you got to have it rape a Squirtle. So then, <laughs> so then comedically the Squirtle can go, Squirtle, Squirtle. As it, you know, as it jacks it off with tentacles, you know? Well, there's that other thing that's, like, huge that has, like, hundreds of tentacles. Um, yeah. And I don't know, like, it seems like, you know, we could get some sort of, uh, some scene out of that. I don't know. I can think about it. I don't know. Oh, man. Like that. Look at the way you fade in with, like, a crystal shield. Like, so, like, you know, as, like, stuff bashes into your vehicle that's tussling the fuck, you know, and it really starts to be beat up the shield. Yeah. Then you can, you like, know. think about it. You got all these, like, check out these two. They, like, you know, the Pichu's trying to, like, you know, get a hold of the monkey's ass. And you got all of these giant butterfly women that are, like, fluttering around, like, you know, giggling and, like, caressing each other. You got, you know, the... Big brawny bison, you know, men in the distance, you know, like, you know, wandering around with giant penises, you know, and then you got this triple headed bird, you know, it's like a woman with like, it's like extra big with like, you know, three different, you know, necks and heads and it like goes over and it's like, you know, fucks the bison over there. Everything that happens here just becomes sexual in the movie. You gotta have, man. yeah, you gotta have some, like, Pokemon hanging out in that stream back there. Oh, man. Those apples right there, those gotta be utilized. Those gotta go up some Pokemon's ass. And then you gotta have, like, the insects. Like, they're, like, you know, like, crazy. Like, you know, they got, like, sexy like you know titties coming off of them and like heads of like you know people and they're like you know you know fucking people like you know wrapped around their genitals jacking them off and stuff you know then you the little birds that are angry they're like you know they're like group gang banging the bigger swans you know as the, uh, you know, half-sized, you know, little, you know, micro-sized people that are still humanoid fully, sort of. Yes, but, you know, because it's evil sauce, they're all prematurely ejaculating. Yeah, they're always prematurely ejaculating. So passing by yeah. they're nutting. Yeah, then they're exhausted and they lay there sexily as you, you know, take more video. As then they, in the distance, as they pick up more thrusts again as you move on. Yeah, exactly. That's <laughs> excellent. You fucking, you fucking filthy grunkies. Because secretly, the camera you're using is exciting them even further because of the, uh, you know, whatever. Who gives a crap? The laser, you know. It's got, it's a sex pink infrared laser. Yeah. Oh, man. Cute little weird fanged raccoon things. Oh, man. It, it looks like this bird's sleeping and then they just run up and, uh. Go to town, man. Yeah, they suck his dick as it screams yeah. an orgasm and wakes up so startled. Another three-headed one, yeah, three dicks. 
Incredible. The gnawing action of those teeth on those dicks. Yeah, man. They're real rubbery. Oh, man. Yeah, you got the fish yeah. floundering around, um, you know. And then you got the scene where, you know, he thinks about picking it up and it looks soulfully into his eyes. And then he's like, no, and, like, puts it back. Yeah. It's like, no, I will not let it suck my dick. As it's like, you know, still a fish. Yeah. It's a fucking fish, dude. I don't know about that. Because some of the, you know, birds and fish haven't mutated yet, you know. Not everything's mutated. Yeah, that's why he goes to the safe spot in the woods while uh, Crowley says he has to go out and uh, investigate. (laughs) Yes. Then he he has to recreate the Pokemon. What? What's going on here? There's invisible sexy Pokemon? What are these flowers? They're they're hiding in them, yeah. Yeah. They're, like, invisible. I I can see them. They got eyeballs. I got enough pictures of them, I think. Okay. Huh. Well, they need to go around and, like, you know, I don't even know, like, go down around people's necks and, like, put out perfume that then makes them, like, fuck more evenly, you know? And, like, not orgasm immediately. Like, they have stamina. They spray a fine... Yeah. Uh, Hydro vaporized, uh, you know, water agitated uh, cocaine mist. (laughs) Yes. Exactly. And then it, they are just uh, hanging from the ceiling is uh, <laughs> spools of, of uh, cocaine mist. Yeah. <laughs> to increase sweaty right performance, leaves, you know? yes. Sprayed right onto them. Yes. <laughs> now that's sensual. Man, that was great. Like, that was so informative, that first level. I love uh, that. Was, Join yeah. us next time. So these sleeping buffalants, there was... um a score bunny that was all super sexy and it was hopping along with like it's scorching there it goes so it's like sneaking around and it's like jacking off and like coming all over the, their faces and giant you know sexy black woman froze <laughs> as they're like sleeping here with their like sexy rings on their giant horns you know and everything see look at it it's enjoying itself wow that's sensual Look at all the glowy mushrooms and lights along the path, man. We're, they're looking for an Illumina Pokemon, you know. And what happens is, uh, you know, it sprays more of the coca, you know, leaf type, you know, Illumina mist. And then uh, it, it arouses further excitement. See, that's what I was talking about. Is that the thing with all the tentacles? Yeah, thanks. Yeah, there it is, right? So then, like... There's a bunch of women, like, you know, using it like a, uh, you know, like, you know, smacking around its tentacles and, like, squeezing them and, like, building up cum and then splooging it out into, like, you know, into, like, you know, canisters to, like, you know, make, like, dinner with, you know, with, like, vegetables. It's a Torterra, more (laughs) like Hurricane Tortella of Uh. cum. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at that little boy. Look at his little face. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what to say about those guys. They just, uh, they, uh, get flipped upside down by, you know, some, uh, some of those, uh, you know, bitches, you know, that have the big froze, you know, that are the cows. And then they're like, you know, raping their dicks, you know, expertly. Get the big sexy Pidgeotto, you know, posing around. Damn, that's too spooky. Whoa, that owl spooked out. Oh, there's the crows I was talking about. See the owl and the crows? They fly around and they work for Professor Oak. And they uh, help him get good camera footage from the all different angles, you know, when the sexy bitches are out too far from him and he can't get the good angles yeah exactly yeah he roped ash ash into a dangerous mission and yeah he got smashed by buffaloes that were trying to fuck you know yep. everything. so now he's in the woods oh man for Pikachu the rest of the episode and they get up to check it out there's some like woman who gets you know captured by this guy and he's got her squeezed between his chompers on top of him and then he's all like you know making out with her pussy as she like screams and smacks his back you know as he like drags her off you know into the undergrowth 
Oh man, it's like honeybees uh, that have like collected, you know, you know, <laughs> corrupt pollen. So then, like, they're like, uh, you know, getting eaten by, you know, the different, you know, women, and it's like making their like, you know, tits get all like, you know, crystalline. They're unborn bees stuck in the hive. Yeah. <laughs> they're stuck. Yeah, they're stuck. They're stuck as babies. In, stuck in the honeycomb. That's weird. That's strange. Yeah, you gotta have that. You just gotta have a, a bunny woman laying there, you know, covered, you know, in, in, you know, bee bits, you know, and like come, you know, just like splayed out on top of that thing. And then, the, yes, on top of it. And then she goes, coughs and goes, splat. Yeah. Tons of bee. There's tons of honey that's just yeah. out of her mouth all over her breast. Yeah, exactly. And she coughs a bunch, yes. You know, that was an excellent mission. That was, again, very productive of semen and titty milk yes, and all the rest. I enjoyed that one as well. Boom, check it out. It's that it's that little bird, but now it's been uh, mutated with the chemicals. Yes, it's super jacked. I'm not implying you should get somebody this jacked because they totally probably are on steroids. Instead, you just make, you know, CG them like they're this yeah, jacked. Yeah, like everybody's just, just regular shape. Anybody know? who's too jacked, you just CG them bigger because they got to have a functional, you know, seven inch dick. So, yeah. you know. <clears throat> Anyways, I was thinking about in that last level, uh, we definitely, you know, I need to have more, uh, another swarm of honeybees, you know, show up to that, you know, rabbit woman laying on top of the big turtle dude. And then, like, um,. There, she's like, oh no, and then they're all, you know, like, you know, squeezing more, you know, honey into all of her holes, you know, or like her nose and ears and everything too, you know. It's really kinky. Because the, the bees are called, uh, whatever they're called, I forgot. You see, this cat is made out of potassium nitrate, sul sulfur, and charcoal. <laughs> out of different parts of the length of its body. Yeah. And so it strikes its tail against the ground. Then I was saying, because it, it was stupid, it, it would just uh, light its own back on fire and then fire it. And it fires with the sound of a Smith & Wesson 500. Yeah. And it has a ring of fire like it's a lion jumping through it. And it, it shoots a big old ball of fire, you know what I'm saying? So I said instead the tail should go up its own ass. And that's why it has a strong digestion, you know, I put yeah. that there. Because, you know, it digests anything instantly, like an apex predator, by sticking its tail up its own ass and then blowing it up. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's, it's a the digestion, and then it... But so when it's, it's, you know, empty of anything in there, then instead it just does that to instantly super come, you know, as its special sex move. When it's, yes, it's special Pokemon sex attack. So then, you know, it's banging, like, say, whoever is, uh, you know, in the woods, yeah. who's, uh, you know, gets captured by its, like mountain yeah. lion ways oh i think it should be captured ash ash should be wandering around picking apples far away from yes. the ruckus but then this pokemon shows up and it's too powerful to transform fully so instead it's just you know because it like chokes out the 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 chemicals through the fireballs and like blasts them up everywhere so it's like super horny and, like blasting fireballs all over yeah so then when it comes it has this giant roar and <laughs> Who pitches its head back as the sound of a Smith and Wesson fire yeah. blasts in the air as it shoots an enormous fireball with its body all ripped? Yeah. Oh, it's so good. It's so yeah. funny. It's, it's flames instantly roast the whole tree, you know? Yes, exactly. Roast the palm tree and the little bits of it fall through the yeah. air dramatically around it. Yeah. That's epic. We got a sexy clown man dolphin who, um, his, um, he meets, like, a woman who was always, like, a clown with huge titties. Like, she's been obsessed with it her whole life. And yes. she never had, you know, someone to help her with her, you know, clown act. So then this clown dolphin transforms, you know. He was always extra colorful dolphin, you know. And he was all different colors. <laughs> so then now he's a... 
Now he's he's reached his full evolutionary prowess here. Yes, you see the cum bubble, his Spider-Man cum bubble coming out of his arm that he can manipulate. I don't know. Is it? <laughs> I think it's just he jizzes it out like a giant sperm. Then he grabs it and like sticks to his... Like, like a ball and chain. Yeah, like a ball and chain it shows. <laughs> <laughs> see? <laughs> Never go full leotard. And then he's super indestructible because he can like... Go like you know, squeezy clown mode. I call so like, it jumbo combo mode. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like see, so he, he bubble- hydro inflates his semen cells. Yeah, and then they're like you know, like super bouncy, and like you know, he can like you know, he like bash people with them, and it like makes them all get like all goofy, you know, like they're all like woo woo as stars go around, you know, as they get all conked. Now. <clears throat> This next one may be a little graphic. I'm not personally into owl porn. Yeah. But uh, here's like an owl that like, instead of throwing these daggers, you know, you see here. Yeah. Yeah, I was saying you should have like super sensual like feathers that it like puts out that are like more downy. So when it's like making love to whatever like, you know, gay dude, he's like, you know, with like, you know, and it's all like caressing uh, his you know chest and nipples with swirls of little feathers that are downy <laughs> flowing around magically it's like guardians of go hool baby <laughs> yeah it's real sensual let me tell you so yeah you know here's the here's the lineup of introduced characters you know, yeah there, there's the three look at them they're look magnificent <laughs> sex cat <laughs> rank clown and and sensual owl <laughs> yeah Voice acted by Antonio Banderas. <laughs> okay. No, I'm just yeah, kidding. I don't know about that, yeah. Oh, also, this tragedy. Yeah, what the hell have they done? What have they done? What have they done to my boy, I mean, girl? Yeah, like, just to reference here, yeah, they started out with, like, gazongas that might, you know, fit in in, like, a, you know, a Star Wars movie or something, yeah. you know, and then... This is what they do. They like their fake anime people because it was anime to begin with. She just looked like she was, you know, 35. And then they animate her down to like 11 again. Yeah, exactly. It's just not right. You can't do that. Why they flattened the ass? Even if you were going to yeah. do that, she should have a pert ass and she doesn't have a pert putty, pert, pert putty puffy. Like you see this one over here is just a little more, she's so much larger like her ass. You don't even see it. You've <laughs> shrunk her character model. Look, yeah. it sizes down. Look at no, She's so short. Look at how tiny she is. Like more of her fits. You can see all the way down to nearly to her knee. And over here, you can barely see the ass at all. Incredible. Yeah, so anyways, you were talking about frog mutation? Well, here's, yeah. here's the unreleased Pokemon frog. Yeah, there it is. There it is, baby. It yeah, was there so the whole like, time. So, like, all of the frogs, like, you know, and the, there's, like, the hypnotism frog. So then, like, it's, like, you know, it, there's, like, two of them that are, like, you know you know, raping her nostrils, and it's like, they're like tiny, and they like, they're like whirling around, so her eyeballs are all, you know, can't, can't focus. Yes, they twirl one direction while her eyeballs yeah. turn purple, and twirl the other yeah. direction with spirals, like anime-like, for no reason. Yeah. Even though it's live action. Meanwhile, these other frogs are like, you know, got their mouths open wide, and they're like sucking, you know, on their, on her whole titties, you know? Yes. Like, it with like their big, you know, bottoms of their mouths protruding out <laughs> to like shape around their, her titties, you know? And then they're, like, slowly inflating, inflating with their titty milk, you know? As she's, like, mutating from, like, the, the goo, you know, she yes. landed right next to as she's, like, grown an enormous, you know, green dick. Exactly. <laughs> That's what I was Pink talking Vivian about. dick. Yes. And it, like, you know, it, like, is prehensile, you know? Yeah. So it can, like, you know, quest around for hot pussy, you know? Exactly. But anyway, It's like, I got a mind of its own anyways, but... <laughs> <laughs> I just, I think we're running out of battery. So oh, yeah, yeah. Out.